Hi, I'm Steve Richardson. We've all heard the story about the guy who gets pulled over for drunk driving and the police officer asks him to walk a straight line. What's all that about? Well, it's actually a specific test called a walk and turn test, which is administered by a police officer to determine whether he has probable cause to arrest you for drunk driving. You're instructed to take nine steps, heel to toe, forward, turn, and then take nine steps, heel to toe, back. And while you're doing that, the officer is looking for eight things. He's looking to see if you have difficulty maintaining your balance while you're listening to the instructions. He's looking to see whether you start the test before he's finished explaining it. Then, do you take the, an improper number of steps in either direction? In other words, you take um, eight steps forward and seven steps back. And he looks to see whether you made an improper turn in turning around to come back. Then he'll look to see whether you failed to touch heel to toe. Also, did you stop the test to re regain your balance? Did you step off the line to maintain your balance? Or did you put your hands out to your sides to try and retain your balance? If you did at least two of these things, then the officer has probable cause to arrest you. If you've been arrested for drunk driving in southern New Jersey, please feel free to give my office a call to set up an appointment to come in talk about your case and what defenses you may have.